The Classic Lamp Post Company offers unique reproductions of early American decorative lighting posts and luminaires. Classic Lamp Post is the exclusive manufacturer of the polysteel lamp post. This affordable post looks just like cast iron, but because of its construction, it is virtually maintenance free. It will never rust, corrode, or need painting. Polysteel posts have been tested to minus 40 degrees below zero with no change in surface appearance. The polysteel post is a unique three-part composite structure that is molded in our own factory where quality control is constantly maintained. First, linear low-density polyethylene resin is added to the mold. This unique space-age polymer is the same material used to coat telephone lines. Ultraviolet stabilizers are added to the material, making it impervious to sun, heat, cold, wind, and rain. A galvanized Schedule 40 steel pipe is then inserted into the center of the aluminum mold. The mold is closed and inserted into the oven where it is heated to approximately 600 degrees. The heated polyethylene forms the decorative flutes, base, and burial base all in one piece around the steel center pipe. After the mold has cooled, the post is removed from the mold. The rich black color of the exterior is not a paint coating, but the color of the material itself. To complete the process, a structural polyurethane material is injected into the space between the center steel pipe and the outside polyethylene exterior. This adds additional rigidity to the post. You can see the structural integrity by this cross section of a finished post. A galvanized steel center pipe surrounded by structural foam protected by a one quarter inch thick decorative exterior of polyethylene is unlike any post ever made. Another unique feature of the polysteel post is the burial base. This is an integral part of the post. It extends approximately 17 inches below the base of the seven foot post. This design allows for a fast labor saving installation as well as enabling the posts to withstand 120 mile per hour winds. To install the polysteel post, a hole must be dug approximately 18 to 20 inches deep for the seven foot post. Building a box form and installing anchor bolts is not necessary. Once the hole is finished, the electrical wiring conduit should be run to the center of the hole by way of an adjacent trench. Run the wiring through a 90 degree elbow at the end of the conduit pipe. Next, run the wiring from the conduit up through the center of the post so that the wires are exposed at the top of the post. The post can now be brought into an upright position. As the post is placed upright, take up the slack in the wiring. Direct the center pipe at the bottom of the post so that it fits over the 90 degree conduit elbow. The post is now ready for the pre-mixed concrete and water. Pour the concrete around the burial base approximately one half to three quarters of the way up the burial base. After the concrete is poured, two by fours can be placed around the post to steady it until the concrete sets. The electrical wiring that was run from the conduit up through the post can now be connected to the wires on the globe fitter. Wire nuts should be used to make the connection. After it is wired, the globe fitter can now be secured to the top of the post by tightening the set screws on the sides of the fitter. The globe luminaire can then be attached to the fitter. This installation required an acorn globe, but any other classic luminaire could have been used. After the concrete is in place, replace the soil and sod at the base of the post. Once the concrete sets, the two by fours can be removed. The advantages of the polysteel posts are low initial cost of post. In fact, polysteel posts are lower in cost compared to most cast iron or aluminum posts. Fast delivery. Made in America means delivery is in weeks, not months, and with lower freight costs. Fast labor-saving installation. Exclusive burial base feature allows for fast, cost-effective installations. Forms and foundations are not necessary. Maintenance free. Polyethylene exterior design means no rust, corrosion, or painting. The polysteel posts are listed with underwriters laboratories and approved by the Canadian Standards Association. Classic lamp post offers two styles of posts, 
the Washington, and the New England. The Washington style has a fluted post with a bell-shaped fluted bottom. The New England style also has a fluted post with a more narrow and cylindrical shaped base. The Washington is available in 7, 9, and 12 foot heights. The New England is available in 7 and 9 foot heights. Along with the lamp posts, Classic also makes available a selection of cast aluminum luminaires. They are reminiscent of old-fashioned gas lanterns that were popular at the turn of the century. You can choose from incandescent, mercury vapor, high-pressure sodium, or metal halide light sources. Also available is our polysteel Victorian three-arm, four-globe luminaire, as well as round or acorn-shaped globes available in either polyethylene or polycarbonate. Along with our lamp posts, we also offer a polysteel bollard made of the same three-part composite material as our lamp posts. It is a reproduction of the 1900s wharf post, historically found in many U.S. seaports. The octagonal base allows for a variable installed total height of 35 to 43 inches. Classic also offers mailbox bases that match the style of the lamp posts. A rural sized mailbox can be mounted on either a polysteel Washington or New England style base. Polysteel posts have been approved and are in use by cities, municipalities, and utilities all across the country. They have been proven in installations coast to coast in all types of climates and weather conditions. The installation shown is located in the city of Davie, Florida. Before these posts were installed, they had to pass the strict requirements of the local utility. Florida Power and Light. Polysteel posts can be used to enhance entranceways, walkways, courtyards, pools, parking lots, or any application where a decorative lamp post is needed.